Hey, what's up, y'all? Welcome back to another video. Uh, so today I'm going to take you with me to uh, show you kind of like the process of uh, how I fill up my truck. So it's a combination between uh, using a fuel additive, uh, and right now I have my diesel extreme because my truck's been sitting for a long time, uh, and I think it's, this is going to be my second fill up ever since coming back from my vacation. And so I want to give it some treatment. Um, after finishing up this bottle, I'm going to go ahead and start using the Everyday Diesel Treatment from Hot Shot Secrets. Uh, I've heard nothing but great things about that product. And if you're anything like me, I cannot walk down the cereal aisle because there's way too many options. I just pass out. Uh, and that's very similar to the amount of uh, oils and fuel additives that you can actually throw into your truck. So for me, I'm just going to stick with Hot Shots. Um, when I do use fuel treatment, I'll probably use it either every tank or every other tank. Um, you can't, uh, you know, there's nothing like peace of mind. It just helps with the lubricity between the, or within the fuel system, the fuel injectors, uh, the CP4, you know, the entire fuel system. And so that's why I want to uh, use a fuel treatment every tank or every other tank. I don't know why my windshield wipers just went off randomly. Um, but it is 90 degrees and it is 10:45 a.m. and I'm heading to a gas station uh, and uh, I'm actually going to one that uh, Get Upside is recommending. It's telling me it's a dollar and 63 cents per gallon with I think the savings uh, That I have currently right now, so you can't beat that uh, So once I get to the gas station, I'll go ahead and uh, show you what I do for that app I'm also going to utilize a uh, Fuelie app uh, to track my miles per gallon, this is the hand calculated because I think everyone has the Lyometer uh, when it comes to uh, your fuel miles per gallon and there's a way to change that too but I haven't changed that because I'm trying to get an accurate um, ratio between how accurate the uh, truck system is and how hand calculations of the actual miles per gallon that I, that I receive on my truck. Uh, so let me go ahead and get to the gas station and we'll get to this video. Alright guys, so I'm at one gas station and one tip I want to do mention to all y'all is that make sure you go to a busy fuel station. You don't want to go to a small fuel station uh, that they keep diesel in there in their tanks for a long time. Alright, so first thing I wanted to mention is going to get upside and I'll go ahead and put a link in the description below. Guys, y'all already pay for fuel. Go ahead and just use my reference code so that I can uh, just get cheaper fuel based off of all these videos I do so that would be pretty cool if you wanted to go ahead and do that so I am at a fuel station right here it says shell 163 per gallon for diesel and I'm not sure if the camera can pick that up it is right there so what I'm gonna have to go ahead and do is uh, claim this claim in for cash back check in when you arrive pay with any card in your wallet and it says get cash back automatically once your purchase is verified so I'm going to go ahead and fill up um, but first I'm going to go ahead and put in diesel extreme the devil's in the detail in good inside oh a holy crime but how can I hide you without an Yeah. 
everything that brought me alive But we're all like monsters, playing with the monsters They brought me alive, but got no alibi Alright guys, so since this had a blue badge, I did not have to uh, scan a receipt, but I think if you go to a gas station that does not have uh, the blue badge on this app, all you're going to have to do is just scan your receipt. So, make sure you get your receipt. Here's mine. So, next what I'm going about to do is actually uh, hand calculate my miles per gallon for this tank. Alright, so here's my fuel app. I opened it up, so now I have to enter a fuel up. Alright, so first things, I'm going to have to put in my odometer. It is 49.12. So let's go ahead and put that in, 49.12. There it is. Previous odometer, that was my last fill up, 45.53. So it automatically subtracts this mileage from that. Price is gonna be 189.9, okay. That's it. Volume, I had 27,892 gallons. 27,892 gallons. Good to go. Total cost 52.97 and automatically generated. Uh, and that's exactly what I paid. So partial fill up, no, this was a full fill up. Blah, 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 blah. I scroll all the way down. You can, I guess, add some photos, PDFs, maybe of the receipt or a certain fuel station. What I like putting in the notes is actually what the computer is telling me all right so i can go back if, you know just make sure that um just to confirm how off my lyometer is all right and so i'm going to go ahead and put in just the average miles per gallon the uh distance that i've gone 359.2 and uh put that in the notes i also put in notes of if i used any fuel additive you know just to to uh, keep track of what i've done and you know if if one fuel tank was like crazy you know 18 miles per gallon i go back and see like oh what did i do different based off of my previous fill ups so i'm going to go ahead and throw in my notes all right guys so that's what i entered 359 miles travel computer says 14.1 miles per gallon go ahead and save right there all right and then it generated let's go to statistics and overall scroll down fuel up Last miles per gallon, 12.8. So, 12.87. Let's go to browse and check out what it actually is saying about this specific fuel fill up. I think the camera can pick this up. Yep, this is it, exactly it. So, 12.871, 359 miles traveled. Not too shabby for a four inch lift on 37s by 12 and a half. Let me go ahead and figure out what the difference is uh, between 14.1 and 12.8 because I could do 14.1 minus 12.8 let's give it that seven see how far it is off 1.23 so uh, one and a quarter uh, miles per gallon off so I mean I gotta I gotta narrow that in I gotta change I gotta make a uh, program change Probably. all right guys so that is it uh, as you can see this is my normal fuel up process I use get upside and please if you're a follower if you're a subscriber please use my referral code that I'll go ahead and put again right here uh, that helps me out y'all use fuel anyways just go ahead and use my referral start using the system you'll get some money um, it may it may not be like free tank but it'll take some time uh, but you'll get that money back using that app I also use fuelly uh, and that's what keeps me on track based off of uh, checking out what miles per gallon I'm getting from my truck um, not that I care about the fuel mileage in this beast uh, but the fuel mileage does tell you if your truck is some, you know, if something's wrong with your truck. Um, I use that to um, more so ensure that my truck is, is healthy. So if y'all have any questions or comments or any other apps that I think uh, that would be beneficial for me, go ahead and let me know in the comments below. Uh, but until next time, ciao.